Hi there, and welcome to Celeb Hut. Seems as though Drake is being separate up as the following enormous star in this Hollywood to get uncovered. Like Diddy, we have Kendrick Lamar to thank for that. A couple of days after Kendrick uncovered Drake for being a wet blanket in his diss track, meet the Grams and dislike us, a few ladies are currently emerging to guarantee that Diddy, I mean Drake supposedly did a terrible things to them, and purportedly say them. Yet not just that, there are a few reports that the vast majority of the ladies' D.I., scussing the claims are intending to sue Kendrick's insane plate, gave them the boldness they expected to oppose Drake. And all of you want to get in on this right now on the grounds that these ladies haven't arrived to play with Drake. Well, very much like Drake made statements went from zero to 100 genuine speedy, since I simply realized that Drake is presumably someplace wishing that he never got into this hamburger with Kendrick Lamar on the grounds that things have gotten chaotic for him since K. Endrick uncovered him in his diss tracks. And when I say untidy, I imply that he is getting uncovered for Diddy, like violations with allegations that he has purportedly been getting into it with youngsters. The hamburger began in the most insane manner back in 2013. Yet it truly exploded two or three weeks prior when J. Cole Nam dropped Kendrick in his tune with Drake Furster's shooter, where he said, L, and they are you, the hottest him see, is at Aubrey on me. We the huge three, like we began an Asok, Iation. Yet at this moment, I feel like Muhammad Ali. No, this didn't agree with Dr. Kendrick. No. He chose to applaud back at J. Cole and Drake in his collab with Metro Blast. Entitled like that, he said. And it's up lost an excessive number of troopers not to play your safe, assuming that you stroll around with that stick. Hit ain't Andre 3KD, I won't drop the area. I actually got PTSD from Mother F, the large three ninjas. It's enormous to me, definitely. We felt that J. Cole planned to engage in that three-manner meet, yet he ned his way up out of that thing, saying Zari to Kendrick at his Dreamville show. Yet he never really finished the hamburger between Drake and Kendrick on the grounds that those two began grinding away. Now we have been seeing a ton of rapper hamburgers in recent years, yet what makes this specific hamburger chaotic is that both Kendrick and Drake battled grimy Drake delivered two diss tracks, smearing Kendrick, and afterward, Kendrick answered with his six-minute diss track title, Euphoria, where he came for Drake's throat. Drake then dropped one more tune, Family Matters, in which he played into the gossipy tidbits about Kendrick being vicious and putting hands on his life partner. Whitney, now for the people who don't have a clue about the two, or quite a while back, a few cases about Kendrick were being brutal. Kendrick denied these cases and excused them as misleading goodness way. This is valid, no doubt, when they said you were in Vegas and you beat some person horrendous and you did something to some female and they said they had proof in all of this. And afterward, I at absolutely no point ever heard anything about it in the future. No doubt. Because it's silliness that is the most uninformed stuff I've made up on, that I question it and you realize that individual who made that up owes a conciliatory sentiment. Anti not to me, but rather to ladies that truly go out there and get mishandled. You dig what I'm talking about, that is a main problem. And to put uh, an individual name that, that, you know, that represents some far more better that has been raised, far more better than that, that is, that is not cool. There are individuals out there that truly get manhandled. And there's ladies out there that get misused and don't say anything. You know, experience their lee through that. So I was like, I'm certain that in the event that that happened, they would have been police and you would have been captured. That is stupidity. That is oblivious. That is all oblivious to a hundred percent. When you hear things in the new certain things I accept about craftsmen that story, I didn't feel that was a remotely anecdote about you. And I was like, as of now, Kendrick was determined to even the score, and he chose to drag Drake into the mud, talking on charges of Drake supposedly acting improperly with youngsters. He dropped another diss track where he blamed Drake for this, and he name-dropped Drake's mother, saying Sandra plunked down. What I'm going to say is weighty. Now listen, your child's a wiped-out man with wiped-out considerations. 
I think ninjas like him ought to kick the bucket, and Weinstein ought to get effed up in the phone until the end of their lives. He despises people of color who hypersexualize them with crimps of a neo-obsession with GR beard growth, since he comprehended that being a facial hair growth just fit him better. He got sex guilty parties on Hovo that he kept on a month to month stipend. A kid ought to never be compromising. He keeps his kid around them. We got to bring up our little girls, knowing there are hunters like him sneaking you all. Kendrick's words most certainly did the desired expectation, and he had individuals doing a ton of diving into Drake's past. We should say that we found a ton of truly odd stuff happening in his past, including how he supposedly had been taking care of casualties of his unfortunate behavior for quite a while now. On the off chance that you have been paying attention to the roads for some time, you have definitely had some significant awareness of these charges that Drake acts unpleasant around more youthful young ladies. Take, for example, the circumstance with Millie. Bobby Earthy colored when Millie was just 14, she uncovered in a meeting that she and Drake had been messaging a ton of individuals in the incorrect way on the grounds that Millie uncovered that Drake regularly conversed with her about young men. This was totally an indication of prepping on the grounds that she was just 14 at the time, while Drake was a completely mature man in his 30s. Everything about your relationship with Drake says a lot a lot to me about your companionship. How did this all come about? I love him. I met him in Australia. And, um, he's really phenomenal. An extraordinary companion. And an incredible, incredible good example. You know, we messaged. We just messaged each other a day or two ago. And he seemed to miss you so much. I feel like I miss you more. He's coming to Atlanta. So I'm certainly going to take a brief trip and see him. I'm so energized. No doubt, what guidance does he give you? Like, what does he express? Uh, about young men, he helps me. No doubt, better believe it. No doubt, he's incredible, he's superb. I love him with young men. He additionally messaged Billy Ish when she was only 17, and he was in his full 30 ass. And the way that he was dating Bella Harris the second she turned 18. Or him kissing a 17-year-old fan in front of an audience after she let him know that she was 17. I could go on and on all day about the reports that Drake supposedly recruits individuals just to assist him with getting young ladies. No doubt the roads were saying a wide range of things and uncovering a ton about Drake, yet it didn't take extremely ill. Angthy for the circumstance to deteriorate on the grounds that a few new charges faced him like this individual that guaranteed that Diddy. I mean, wow, that continued to do. That Drake purportedly had secondary school young ladies at his gatherings and his chateaus. Assuming I'm overall genuine with you, brother experiencing childhood in secondary school, 16, 17, 18, having eyes only for the baddest young lady in your school, and afterwards seeing her post at Drake's house each and every time, seeing Drake, uh, and the follows. You don't have any idea how crippling that is to a youthful teen kid in Canada. So on the off chance that I will be genuine, I've been hanging tight for this person's ruin, briefly. I'm going still knock his music cause that now Biadi goes off the deep end. Yet this is for the more youthful ages, they don't need to manage that. Biadi not anymore. Then, at that point, there's this old video of him acting unpleasant with individuals from a young lady band. The OMG Young Ladies. This was at the 2009 Wagered Grants, where he and Little Wayne had an exhibition. They raised the OMG young ladies on the stage, and presently one point you all can see. Drake act unusual towards one of the young ladies, and she certainly looked awkward. Young lady is going like Christmas, I like caramel skin, longy ass. And I swore yet, the most out of control part about this story is that back in 2019, Drake purportedly paid a lady $350,000 after she blamed him for S.A. and the story S.U. B-sided after that, I mean Drake's group got their work done and concealed this greatly. And pretty much every notice of the S.A. case has been scoured from the web. Yet the lady Leah Trim gave a few meetings discussing what is happening and how Drake supposedly saw her yet the meeting some way or another bafflingly vanished from the web. Yet you all understand what I generally say when I have a few teeth for you all on the grounds that the web always remembers, and I figured out how to find one video of Layla discussing the occurrence. 
and you all need to catch wind of it yourselves. How sure are you that you're pregnant by Drake and not another person? Let me let you know something, and I'm going. Make this unmistakable, because you realize I have been asked that before. Mainstream, I have a kid. Okay, I'm a mother currently. Okay. I know who I lay down with unprotected period, so it's 100% sure he knows it. So toward the day's end, I'ma leave it at that, you know? And when you move toward him about it since you let him know you were pregnant, right? What was his reaction to that data? He essentially was very much like gracious, everything off base. And afterward, I said to him, and he basically resembled, I'm get back to you, and the calls recently quit. Everything. Halted you all. It seems as though Kendrick was not lying about how Drake is a deadbeat father, on the grounds that purportedly Drake additionally has one more child with another lady named Shavia Mirick, yet he supposedly got her pregnant and ghosted her wick. H is insane. Now I figured out how to track down a couple of photos of the child, and you all eventual lying on the off chance that you said that this kid didn't seem to be Drake since he took Drake's whole face. It's insane. I would have thought it was artificial intelligence in the event that she didn't recount to her story. Yet here's another unexpected development. Since word on the roads is that Drake has supposedly subscribed Celeb Hut for more videos.